Yep, here it is from the street. Uh, night, old 1920s bungalow. It's got a little windmill vane in the or the tower over on this side of it. You can't really see it. All right, let's go check it out. Out here in the uh, cornfields of Indiana. This old abandoned house here. Whew. Man, these spider webs are crazy. Some sort of old garage here. Holy shit. All these little bins. Single car garage. Best I could tell, this place is built 1921. So uh, this is probably built for a Model T <laughs> when they built it. All right, check out the inside. This place is extremely moldy. Very decayed. The floor is, is uh, very, very, very questionable. This is what I'm dealing with back here. Hole in the floor there. Really, really decayed ceiling. This thing's got some beautiful trim in here though. Beautiful built ins in here. Sorry, this car is going by. Uh... 
It's got the bevel glass and, and the doors, if y'all can see that. Very pretty, very nice. Give you a pan in the room there. Some bad, bad roof leaks. I think they got really, really bad roof on it. Pretty small bevel glasses in that window. This definitely has a, a mission style to it. Definitely a mission style trim and newel post. Oh, let's see what's upstairs. I don't know. Really, really sketchy. This place stinks really, really, really bad. Raccoon shit in there. Oh shit. Alright. Duck shut. Wow. Yeah. Huh. Holy shit. Wow. There ain't much left of this room. Houses here have really small stairways. Here's the kitchen. What's in here? Oh, yeah, the basement. Okay, we'll get to that in a minute. Well, that's a real small corner kitchen right there, but it's just neat because it's so old. Real old looking. Whew, man. I don't know about these basement stairs. They look very questionable. Heating tank, oil heating tank there. Whew. I do not like going in these basements. This one's been flooded kind of bad too. Like 
an old heater there, furnace, piece of an old furnace there. I think it must be the hot water tank or some kind of tank. Now. Myers water system. Wow, that's pretty old. water pump or something like that. Yeah, this camera don't want to focus. Well, wow, that old mattress there. Pretty crazy. Tons old paint cans. Alright. Like it's just a partial basement. Those little like kind of old shoes there. Alright. That's your basement. There's some cool buildings out here. Old, oh, it looks like an outhouse. Go over here and try to get that. I don't know what this was, but it flat collapsed. Looks like an old outhouse. Oh man, do I dare open it? Yeah, it is a little outhouse. Very cool. Very, very cool. That little outhouse there, boy, that's a one seater. All right, appreciate you guys watching. Y'all take care.
and that porch is way up in the air. Let's see if I can go down here to this road it's on. If you can see it or not, not the best shot of it, but I see it right there. Man, I wish I had a pair of long pants on. A little house over here in eastern Tennessee. And the well there, it's got a tank on it. It says well trough. I don't know if you can see that or not. Go on and check this thing out. I say 1985. That toilet right there. Dark dauber nest up here. They put cheat rock over the uh, tongue and groove. Yeah. Looks like it might have been a dining room or something at one time. There's a bat, and I walked right by him and didn't even see him. Oh my god, okay, well, there ain't a whole lot I can do about that now. Wow, people have tagged this room pretty good. A dining room too, so I don't know what that back room would have been. It's got a fireplace in it. There's the front door. porch Man, that roof is pretty bad snow shovel laying on the floor <laughs> I don't know what that is it looks kind of like it might have been some 
dead bat carcasses or something over there. Not real sure. You can definitely hear that highway in here quite well. Somebody robbed the uh, fireplace panel there. Everybody seems so close up when you're trying to film stuff. It makes everything so close up. We really don't look that way in a lot of real life. <sighs> I guess that has to do with like the dimensional things when you see. Two dimensional, three dimensional, I don't know. Whew, God, these mosquitoes are terrible. the path to the basement. Yep. We'll get to that in a minute. Wow. Sitting in there, I got tore up or something. Holy crap! Okay, I know there's like a pause whenever I come into a room. Sometimes it's just kind of checking the ceiling for bats. Whew, man, it stinks in here. When that little door goes outside, looks like that thing's been added on before. I put up a blanket over the door. Pretty good size house. Whew. This little small back room here has got some kind of cheap linoleum tile on the floor. That little basement door. <laughs> Feel like coming in from the front door. There's the stairs. So go check that out. Hopefully, there's no bats in here. It's kind of weird. I saw a bat. In that one room, but I don't see any so far. Whew, man. Definitely quite a bit hotter up here. Buzzy wasp over there. The attic. Whew, man, it just smell the raccoons in here, so, you know. Iffy at best. Okay. 
that's just another part of the attic in there. I'm not going in there. Forget it. This is like a one and a half story because even though it's got the staircase, it's like the whole the top part of it ain't completely finished. Let's go back in this room, I guess. So I can go ahead and try to finish this up. Ooh, yeah. More wasp hole in the ceiling there. Whoa. Okay, I'm backing up. There's wasp in there. Oh, like some kind of workshop table or something there. All right, I'm going back downstairs. Maybe we'll have better luck with the basement. Staircase is shaking when I step on it. Uh, I probably shouldn't be doing this. It looks like it's got a dirt floor, and there's really not much down here. Whoa. That step is broken right there. Let's see if I can step down to the next one. Holy shit. That door goes outside. I remember seeing that when I came in. Maybe we'll just I think we'll just leave out this way. I don't have to figure out how to get around that bat. There's no heating or... Oh, that's cool right there. Let's get that. An old Schlitz display for a store. to get out of here. <sighs> that old tractor tire there. Okay. Some nasty old spiders. Bunch of old tires in here. I'm storing all kind of stuff up under the porch. Well, it just looks like a bunch of old junk. It don't really look like much or nothing really. This just comes out from up under the front porch. I don't know if you can see that. It comes out from up under the front porch. We're basically back where we started from. I'm gonna go, there's a little barn back here. I'm gonna go check it out. Look at all them old hooks. 
one of them sticks in there. Y'all know what that is, let me know. It looked like it might be something, maybe they used to hang tobacco on or something. Not real sure. Sorry, I'm freaking out. There's a spider right next to me. Okay. There's a loft that goes up there. Whew, God, these mosquitoes are about to eat me up. An old bottle here. What is that? Huh. Very weird. There's a bunch of old tires in there. I have no idea what that is. Poison. Whatever it is, it's poison. Look, this old barn's made out of out of logs. This is an old, old, old barn. Made out of rough cut logs. All right, appreciate y'all watching. Appreciate y'all checking out this house over here in Eastern Tennessee. Catch y'all later.